In downtown Riverhead, there's an old building where the history of a family is kept new. For someone who's never been here, yeah. how do you how do you describe this place? What's the stepping into yesterday? Yeah. <laughs> and you're my friend. Yeah. You're my friend as soon as you walk in. My name is Anthony Maris. <laughs> I am third generation owner of Star Confectionery in Riverhead, New York. When I came in in 91, I was just going to do the summer, and then my uncle abruptly retired. I was like, oh, well, look, I can't. My father wasn't going to do it by himself. And uh, that's when we were like, all right, so what are we going to do? And then, all right, I said, let me try. And I, you know, I burnt a lot of eggs. And a lot of, <laughs> uh, it was a, there's been a lot of mistakes. Tell me about this amazing building. Yes. It's like a historic it's building, It's so right? cool. The building is 1875-ish. Its inception was a general store. In 1911, my grandfather's cousin came in and he built the parlor as what it is today. You know, like uh, here, this right here, these, this handle is from the 20s. And this place has a special menu too, because don't you make your own ice cream? Yes, yes I do. My uncle was the one who made it, and then my father was making it for a long time, and then he taught me, and I can That's do that, and my, awesome. my eyes closed as well. Yeah. This is my grandfather. That's Papa Nick. He called for his wife from Greece, and she came out and uh, the rest is history. Your dad ran yes. this place before he passed recently. Yes. Can you tell me a little bit about your dad? He was the best. Um, it's fresh, so I, I might get a little emotional, I'm sorry, but um, he, I've described him as he was the engine and he was the motor of this place. He was this corner of Riverhead. Hey, Malaka, what are you doing? Who would you describe as your main clientele? Um, when it's busy, I would say they're from up west. I don't know anybody. So, uh, when it's real busy. Okay. But. But you're, you're open here, year round. Basis, year round, it's my locals. Yeah. They're my heart and soul, they're my everything. There are people that just come in and sit in the same booth. What do you think the regulars gain when they come in here? What do you think keeps them coming back? I think back? it's comfort. I think it's, they're comfortable. I have regulars that come in that they came in with their grandparents. But it's funny when I see people that aren't quite regulars, mm -hmm. but I do know them and I don't have my apron on and I'll see them in wherever. You know, not in Riverhead, like maybe Southampton or yeah. golfing or something and I'll go, hey, how are you? And they'll go, and I'll go, cheese omelet, right toast? Oh my God. And my mom used to joke around with my father. They would say, um, and my mom would say, oh, you know that couple, and my father would say, my, like me, no, nah, I don't know who you're talking about. He goes, you know, chicken salad, right? Oh, yeah, I know exactly who you're talking about. Oh. So those are things that uh, they've instilled in me. And, That's awesome. Um, like I said, it's, it's, it's a great legacy and tradition to have.